Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. Once again, this is Rachnam with you guys and a new video. So today it's not a haul, it's actually an unboxing and I got the box here. Um, as you already know from the title, it's about a bag um, and a very good brand. I love um, collecting bags and I also love this brand. Um, a little bit history about this bag, uh, like why I bought it, what's so different. So actually, as you guys can see nowadays, velvet is trending actually it was very uh it was trending in 2018 and in 2019 also i think it's gonna be a very good um choice especially for bags and mules um i have seen velvet trending from different brands like gucci and ysl so i was looking for this bag for a very very long time i checked the website i checked ysl store in my area i actually even called them to check if they have uh, this particular bag uh, available somewhere it was not so I waited for I think almost three to four months um, and then I kept checking online kept checking online that if they uh, have this back in stock and I can order it what's so special about this bag it's velvet it's one of the most beautiful like royal uh, color and also it's perfect size it's perfect size so I've been lately using more crossbodies and I think this is perfect size uh, before getting into the unboxing I don't know if you guys noticed there's something different with my hair so I actually recently got Brazilian blowout done this is not my first time I have got it done in the past but I usually get it done in four to five months because my hair tend to become very frizzy and dry and I got it last time before winter started and now before summer started i'm like i have had to get it done so that my hair looks healthier shiny let me know if you guys like it on me or not definitely my hair is more sleeker and straighter now but yeah that's about it okay let's get into unboxing if you guys are interested in watching such videos please stay tuned and keep watching if you're not if this video is not for you then that's also fine um you guys can leave now and maybe next video will uh more be uh, will be more appealing for you guys but okay uh, for those who are gonna watch this video with me let's do unboxing so i really want to do unboxing with you guys so i haven't i haven't seen what's inside the box i haven't opened it yet um and to answer, uh, of course, because I said that it was very tough to find this bag and how I got it. I didn't get it on my sell website or store. As I said, it was all sold out from everywhere. Uh, I actually went to one of my very, very, very uh, favorite online shopping store, which is Farfetch. It's, it's wonderful. Sometimes the things you cannot get in U.S., you get it internationally and this site connects with you connects you with all the different stores and uh, brands internationally so i was able to locate this bag at a store in italy and because farfetch makes it so easy for you to order it online i was able to order it and i got this right away okay so some of the details about the package i of course there's nothing fancy about the package just the regular brown box uh the only thing which caught my eye is this cute hurt um on the packaging on the box actually so cute uh, so it says farfetch in the corner but it is you know guys what it is it's indian uh sorry not indian it's italian flag so it's a flag from italy and it does it's in shape of herd so i really like this gesture it's so cute so thoughtful 
um now i would definitely like to open this box with you guys so okay let's see here you go here you go far fetch whoops something just fell down what it is okay let's see so it says base blue base blue oh base blue is the store which had this bag available in the color i wanted um founded in 1982 it has been setting the standard for elegance with the best selection of top fashion luxury brands and exclusive items uh it's in piaggia podesta to what i say italy thank you base blue thank you only because of you i have this bag today <laughs> um and then inside this is the bag i mean the box saint laurent so as you can see the classic black bag with white uh, name written right here what else is in the box i got the ribbon the black ribbon of base blue the store and then I got my commercial invoice here with all the details uh, because it was bought in Italy. The currency is different. It's not in USD dollars. I mean, not in USD, but that's fine. I, I'm not sure if I paid an exchange rate or not, um, but this bag is made up of 100% leather and 100% uh, velvet so leather is inside velvet is outside i think so uh, i'll have i'll show you guys this bag is saint loren small lulu monogram bag oh so cute i love the word lulu my friends can relate to it um and the good thing about this good thing about buying from farfetch is that i don't think you pay taxes because it's outside of us plus you don't pay any duties so delivery and duty is paid it's written here the items you have ordered are inclusive of all import duties this means you will not receive a duty bill from the shipper to receive your order isn't it amazing so i end up saving good amount of money here okay let's get this box out of the way and there's a ribbon also i don't need this and let's actually get into actual unboxing so okay so i remove this and here is it okay one more thing did you guys notice that i'm wearing a velvet top yes velvet is in trend i love this top i'm intentionally wearing black so that my back color will pop up but i have exact same color top uh, as well so exact same color of my bag i have the top as well but okay going back to the unboxing sorry i got like i get distracted so easily some tissues which i don't know i didn't like it but doesn't matter and here is the dust bag a nice decent black dust bag can you see the size like it's so small i love small bags and the moment of reveal actually no because it is still packed in a lot of tissue um so this is this is a strap okay oh it has far fetch um something a string don't need this anymore and let me remove all the tissues from here or all the packaging from here so this is the strap and this is dark green i'm not sure if you guys can tell because with the black i'm not sure if you guys can tell but this is the bag let's unbox together or unveil together or unpack together oh my goodness i cannot believe so as i said i'm seeing this for the first time 
with you guys i really wanted to do unboxing in front of camera so that you guys can relate to my emotions and feelings and how much i waited for this bag and why i was not able to get it anywhere because it's such a pretty color and it is limited edition so i was not able to find it anywhere okay so it's a very nice velvet i have another um, gucci velvet bag which uh, mr husband gifted me on my birthday last year so that is also pretty and that color is uh, more like pink uh, magenta color uh, but this color is emerald green so i love such colors which are very deep colors which can go with a lot of stuff um plus i love the gold hardware so as you can see it has gold ysl the signature ysl logo um here and as you open it it has a leather inside so all the interior is 100% leather, exterior is 100% velvet. And some more tissue. Um, I don't know if you guys can see. This is again 100% leather inside. So it is divided. It has two compartments, one right here, one here. Um, and the center there is a pocket and I have something in here okay Saint Laurent Paris uh, bag made in Italy it's clearly written actually I love bags which are made in Paris or Italy I don't know for some reason it gives us this feeling of like more authentic I'm not sure if that's true but Okay, so it has the more like authenticity kind of card, a take care or a care guide in the small pouch uh, and a number which I'm not going to share here. We should, we should always keep the number confidential, uh, especially of all the authentic stuff because that is unique for each item um but as you guys can see other than this ysl logo here it is um, on this magnetic button it's also written saint laurent paris um i told you guys there are two compartments right here with a middle pocket right here i'll i'll put some close-up uh, shots as well let me see what's inside okay here is written saint laurent paris right here and then there is a chain right here um, and there is actually a card holder on the side so just behind this there is a card holder so actually you don't need a wallet or a small pouch or anything with this because uh, you can put your makeup on one side you can put your phone on one side and then you have chain for your um, cash and then you have card holders inside so card pockets inside so you can put your cards as well um, so this is the front this is the side and this is the behind okay the chain is or the strap is removable it's all leather it's removable it has also got the gold hardware one thing to notice is it's not that shiny gold it's more of uh, antique gold which is what I like, I think, because it's more, um, it gives that touch of luxury to the item. It doesn't look tacky. Uh, it has, uh, so the strap also has Saint Laurent written right here. Uh, Saint Laurent written right here. You can actually adjust the strap, so, which is great. And then again, Saint Laurent Paris written here as well. Same thing with Gucci uh, velvet bag as well. I've noticed that they also have empty gold hardware. So that is great. Um, the bottom, as you can see, the bottom is also leather, but it doesn't have feet. I mean, I'm not supposed to put it anywhere, I think. I mean, I can put it anywhere. But I mean, it's still flat. Uh, it got a good shape. It got a good uh, size. So let's try putting a phone inside to just 
give you an idea of what size is. So I have Samsung Galaxy Note 9, which is a big phone. I was a little, little scared that will this fit or not, but it looks like this is going to fit. And easy peasy. Yes, this is about the bag. It's again, it's YSL Lulu bag in velvet. It comes in leather. It comes in different shapes. Uh, or should say different sizes, actually. Shape is pretty much the same. Um, but I love this one the most because it's the perfect size for everyday use. Also, it's the perfect color for me. I have black bags. I have pink. Uh, but I never had a green bag. So this is really, really unique. I would not say that it's more of a winter bag. Uh, but... Yeah, I think people would like to use this kind of bag more in winters. I might use it all the time. I don't know. I'll see. So this also comes in black color, which is actually available on the, I think on YSL website, on Seller and web, website as well. This also comes in a red, um, a red maroonish color, which is very pretty as well. I follow a famous um, uh youtuber and instagrammer chase emmy um, um i hope i'm taking her name right but i actually saw this bag first time on her instagram and i loved it i love the red color i love the the type of the bag um but i didn't want the red color because as i said i already have gucci like more like a pinkish bag so i'm like you know what i i let me look for some more colors here and i actually saw that they have green and black i didn't want black too I wanted a green one and thank you for fetch for connecting buyers like me to international um, shops and stores where they sell authentic branded items not just bags you can find anything on farfetch so I have ordered a lot of things from farfetch before it's wonderful website um, so I would definitely suggest to you guys if you cannot find it in store or online at the, at the at the brand's website do check farfetch out you might might be able to find your bag or your item there that's all for the video thanks for watching if you guys have any feedback or comments about this particular bag or about any bag please do let me know in comment section subscribe to my channel put the not uh, turn on the uh, click on notifications bell icon so that you can get updated about my new video thank you for watching see you in the next video bye